boy Robert from RobGeo0407L, and welcome to episode 205 of Logo History. Okay, viewers. Oh, you did. And welcome back to Logo History. Welcome, my name is Donald, and welcome to Logo History Beta. Hey, what's up? Welcome to the 8th episode of Logo History. Hey, guys, welcome back to Logo History. Hello, guys. Welcome to the fifth episode of Logo History. Hey guys, it is your boy here, Zoe Downson. Welcome to the first episode of Requested Logo Sundays. Hello everybody. Today I'm starting a new series called Logo History. Hi guys, welcome to episode 35 of Logo History. What's up guys, welcome back to Logo History. Hey guys, it's your boy, Peter John. Welcome to episode 88 of the Logo History. Hey guys, right here. And we're going to episode 2 of Logo History. Hey there guys, Turgonite here. Hey there guys, it's TVOAV Kids here. And welcome to episode 2 of Logo History. Today we're going to have a look at Google. Today I am going to talk about for episode 18 of Google. Because this is show up to you Logo. Google! Today... We're going to be taking a look at Google. Today, we're taking a look at Google. Today, we're taking a look at Google. Today, we're going to look at Google. Today, we are going to talk about Google. And today's episode I'm doing is Google. For this episode, we're taking a look at Google. And for today's episode, we're going to have a look at Google. Today, I am going to talk about Google. I hope you like it. For this episode, we're taking a look at Google. And today, for Logo History Collab, I'm doing Google. For this episode, we're going to have a look at Google. Let's take a look at the short bio of those of you who don't know what Google is. It is a it is an internet software and computer hardware industry founded on September 4th, 1998 in Menlo Park, California. The people that founded Google are Larry Page and Sergey Brin. Its headquarters are in Mountain View, California. Not Mountain Dew! I, like I'm just saying that uh, I did I did not make a typo on this, but it's Mountain View, not Mountain Dew. I didn't make a typo of this, but I'm just saying, yeah. Its key people are Sundar Pichai, CEO, and Ruth Porat, CFO. They have a wide range of products. As of 2018, there are 85,050 employees. This episode is too long, so... No short bio for it. <laughs> it is a internet search engine found in 1999. Sorry if I don't have a short bio because I'm doing it from episode 76 to the end of this series. Google was founded in 1990 when it was first named Backrub. In 1997, they changed its name to Google, but it was an early beta. In 1998, the Google text would be more bolder and more modelized. In 1999, the text was thinner. And in 2015, the font is now different. Google is the most popular website of all time. Google is a search engine. That began in 1995 as Backrub, and 1997 they changed their name to Google. Here's the short bio for those who don't know what Google is. It is an American multinational technology company founded in 1995 as Backrub. I could definitely go for a Backrub right got, right now, or am I right? In 1997 they changed their name to Google. Okay, never mind. Their website is. The same website that people use every day for information. Google.com. So yeah. There it is. Look, it's my icon! Yay! Because I signed in. Alright. Okay. Um, since I'm on the website, I want to do a little... To, to do like a... Two little Easter eggs. Well, just one. Do a barrel. Right. Three, two, one. Do a barrel. 
So you see? All right. Now, without further ado, let's get started. Now I'm gonna talk about Google. Now, without further ado, let's start. Let's just let's just get on with it. I think. Let's start. So let's start. Let's get started. Now, without further ado, let's get started. Okay. Now I'm gonna talk about Google. Here are the results. Now let's begin. And now, without further ado, let's start. 1995 to 1997 when it, all right when it was first launched it uh well before it's better version it's it um launched as back rub so we have the word back rub in red text 1995 to 1997 the first name was back rub there was the word back rub in red text 1995 to 1997 it was test 1995 to 1997 did you know that back rub Google wasn't actually um, this time all the time wasn't actually Google. It was back rub. 1995 to 1997. And it started as back rub in the beta version. So we just had the word back rub in red text. 1995 to 1997. Before Google was launched, they were going to be named back rub. We just had the word back rub. 1995 to 1997. This is the logo of our first Google's name, back rub. We just have a word back rub in black text. 1995 to 1997. We have the word back rub in red text. Google was originally back rub. 1990 to 1999. Like I said, this was first named back rub. We have the words back rub in red text. 1995 to 1997. So as you guys can see, Google's name used to be back rub. We have the words back rub in red text. And this Google was a very old company. 1995 to 1997. Here we have the logo of the first Google's name, back rub. There is the word back rub in red text. So 1995 to 1997, here's what I use. I use the word back rub. 1995 to 1997, uh, we have the word back rub in red. 1995 to 1997, they started as back rub. We just have the word back rub in red text. All right, now 1997 and 1998. Uh, my apology. My apology is uh, if I skipped a few slides. Uh, um, we just have the word Google, um, but flat. Yeah, this was the better version. 1997, 1998, as a better, there are flat uh, letters that say Google. Better, 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 this is the better version. Alright, so we had the word Google in red, dark red, blue, green, yellow, and uh, red text. And has red, red effect. 1997, 1998, they changed their name from Backrod to Google. And this is the pre launch logo. We have Google in 3D text. 1997 to 1998, we just changed its name to Google. Here we have our word Google in red, black, blue, green, and yellow text. 1997 to 1980, Backrub was changed to Google. We have the capital G in red and the E, the, the, the O in brown. The first O in brown, the second O in blue, the lowercase G in green, and L in yellow with light. 1997 to 1999, as a beta, they finally changed its name to Google. And you may know this looks kind of like a 3D, I don't know if that looks like a 3D effect, but anyway. We have the words Google in red, dark brown, blue, green, and yellow text with a red drop shadow with a red, like... Kind of like 3D. 1997 to 1998. As you guys can see here, we have the words Google in red, dark red, blue, green, yellow, and and red text. 
So we have the words Google on the floor, and we have the words Google with some with some lowercase letters. 1997 to 1998, they changed its name to Google. Here we have the beta version. There is the word Google in red, dark red, blue, green, and yellow text on a red outline. My dad is on the red county eight. This is the best I can do. I do wacky letters. It's E being the most wacky. Nineteen ninety-seven to nineteen ninety-eight. Uh, we have the word Google. The G and E are in red. The O is in maroon. The other O is in blue. The other G is in green. The and the L is in yellow. But and all the letters have a. Red drop shadow. 1997 to 1998. This is for the beta. So we have the word Google in red, dark red, blue, green, and yellow text on a red outline. 1998, when it was first released, it had, it had, um, G and, it's the word Google. It had the word, it, it had the letters G and L in green, O and E, um, in, uh, red, the second O in yellow, and the letter G in blue. 1998. There was a green G, and a red O, and yellow O, a blue G, and green L, and red E that represents Google. 1998, we chose a blue. I do not know what it is. 1998 to 2000, we have a, the word Google with an exclamation mark. And it's and it has the colors blue, red, yellow, and green. Nineteen ninety eight to ninety nine nine we have the Google. The G and the L used to be green. What the rest of them the same. The G is to be in blue or green. Run the rest same to the to the recent. Here's here's the version that with with the with the G with the G the color of the G we have know today and then an exclamation point just like Yahoo. 1998. Uh, we have the word Google in green, red, yellow, blue, green, and red text. 1998. We have the word Google. It got fancy text. 1998 to 1998. We just have the words. Have word Google in green, red, yellow, and blue text. 1998. We have the capital G and the L in green. The first O in red. The second O in yellow and the lowercase G in blue. 1997 to 2006 as an early logo. Now the words Google is in green, red, yellow, and blue. 1998 to 1998. As you see right here, we have the words Google in green, e red, yellow, blue, green, and red text. We have the words Google in, and the G is like a cursive text. And we have the words Google as well with some, with some different colors in the text of the logo. Like I said, we have the words Google and some kind of uppercase and lowercase text in the logo. 1998 to 1998, there is the word Google in green, red, yellow, and blue text. 1998, the G and the blue line at the end make a really good detail. And the E, which is really kind of is clearly what I like about the Nineteen ninety-eight, we have a green G, a red O, a yellow O, a blue G, a green L, and a red E, making the word Google. Nineteen ninety-eight, this is only used for one year, so we have the word Google in green, red, yellow. And blue text. 1998 to 1999. Uh, um, the colors have been rearranged, and here we have an exclamation point. Um, 
possibly to intimidate uh or imitate like the Yahoo logo. Nineteen ninety eight to nineteen ninety nine, the G turned blue and there was an exclamation point. That's blue. Nineteen eighty eight to nineteen ninety one, seven was not this box. Nineteen ninety eight to nineteen ninety nine. Same as the last logo, but the G is now blue, and the exclamation point was a. Is added. It will change to Google with the exclamation point. Possibly to mimic the Yahoo! Yahoo! Logo. 1998 to 1999, same thing, but they added that exclamation point. 1998 to 1999, they added the exclamation point. Now the, now the text has changed to blue, red, yellow, and green text. And they added we added an exclamation point in blue text. 1998 to 1999, same, but the capital G became blue. Texas gloss shows it, exclamation said it, and it's blue. 1997 to 2006, as a late logo, this is the same, but now the words, now, now the G is now blue. And also at the end, there's a blue exclamation mark. 1998 to 1999. Here we have the Google logo with an exclamation point at the end of the E. We have the words Google and blue, red, yellow, uh, blue, green, and red text with the exclamation point at the end of the logo. 1998 to 1999. The first letter G is now in blue text. And also it was added an exclamation point also in blue text. Okay, 1998 to 1999, which is the exact same thing. But the colors have come to be swapped. The letter G needs to have changed. There's an uppercase and lowercase in the exact same code. L is the exact same as my 28. A blue exclamation point got added to the logo. 1998 to 1999. So letter G is now in blue text, and they add an exclamation point to the logo. 1999 to 2013. Uh, we just have the word Google, G in blue, O in red, second sec other O in uh um uh, yellow, G in blue, L in green, and uh E in in red. Yeah, just the word Google. This is the print version, I suppose. 999, 2003, 13, 999, 2010, 2010, 2013, and 2013, 2015. They're both the same thing. The first one right here is the same as last time. Second right here now it's, it has a shadow. Third one, it's a little bit different. And the fourth one, the they uh they uh made the G lighter. And it got 2D again. 1999 to 2014, we have Google. We have... 1999 to 2015, we have Google. 1999 to 2015. This is very similar to the last one. This, this is similar to the, to the last one. Except that it has a different font. Here they are the three versions. 1999 to 2013. We have the word Google in, in um, blue, red, yellow, blue, red, and green text. 1999 to 2015. The G's connected, the dot's gone, and the dot exclamation point's been removed. And the that little line is below the G and not up of the G. And this is their icon. 1999 to 2013 for text. Don't have different colors. And they remove the exclamation point. 1999 to 2013. The shells seen were removed. The exclamation mark was removed. And the fun test changed. 1999 to 2015. Now the words Google is in blue, red, yellow, and green, and the text is now thinner. 
and also the exclamation mark is removed. 1990 to 2013. The word, the exclamation point has been removed. Here's the gray version. Here is the black version. The blue version. The green version, the gold version, and an icon. That was lost. 1999 to 2013. The exclamation point has been removed. The font of the text has changed, and the text is flatter. Here is the gray version, the dark gray version, the blue version, the green version, the yellow version, and the icon. The font changed and the exclamation point has been removed. 1999 to 2010, uh, same year but more 3D, I guess. Nothing, nothing, nothing. The two parts of the shadows. 2000 to 2017, we have have the same color scheme, but this time it's in a different font and there's no exclamation mark. 1999 to 2010, same as the last one, but result 3D. It has gray drop shadow. 1999 to 2010. Same thing, but it's 3D. And this is their, was their icon. 1999 to 2010. Same, but, but it's back to glossiness and shadows. 1999 to 2015. Now the logo is now 3D. 1999 to 2010. The logo is in 3D. That's cool. Here is the white version. The version with two icons. 1999 to 2010. The text is now glossy, and it is on a black shadow. Here is the white version. Two icons and a commercial. Same, but the shells removed. 2007 to 2015. 
Now the logo is a bit 3D. 2010 to 2013, the text is less glossy and the shadow has been removed. Here is the white version and an icon. Except the out is a bit bigger. 2010 to 2013, it became less 3D and a shadow has been removed. 2013 to 2015, these were the last few years before Google switched to its brand new logo. Um, so, just the same as always. Nothing much, just the text is slightly different. It's the print version. 2013 to 2015, this is nostalgia. So, same as the last logo, but it's not 3D anymore. 2013 to this team, CS three slides ago, but it's more brighter and a, sh and a glossiness was removed once again. 2013 to 2015, now the logo is 2D again. 2013 to 2015, the logo is in 2D version. That's cool. Here is another white version, but it's 2D version. A 3D version. Uh, I think and another one of those icons that were old 2013 to 2015 the logo is now 2d here is the white version the 3d version and the icon 2013 to 2015 we have a G the G is a bit bigger same with the E and the other side to 2015, the colors of the text have been slightly modified, but other than that, it's just the same thing. 2013 to 2015, it is now 2D. And finally, 2015 to the present, and, and on September 1st, 2015, Google officially changed its, its logo, so um, now it looks like this, currently. And this is the print version. Alright, and now, it's just a little animation. Oh, wait. Oop, oopsie. Come on. Why is it not corresponding? Alright, press it once. Alright, here we go. Alright, okay, let's, okay, let's see that again. First, word mark, and then just four dots, and it turns to the letter G in, in red, yellow, blue, and green. Traffic to do the present. Now, uh, there are different fonts. I want to see if it's just how this one is. 2017 to the present, it's just the previous logo, but in a simpler font. 2015 to the present, aka 2020, have a G, have the G's in blue. D, 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 in red. The yellow and the other and oh the L and and the O and in green. And finally, 2015 to the present. Uh the font has changed. 2015 to the present, the Google is now standard text and X. And this is the icon. 2015 to the present, the font has changed. 2015 to the present, same, but the text has changed. And finally, 2013 to the present, now the text is a bit bolder now. And it's now more thinner, and the two, and this is now lighter. And finally, 2015 to the present. The logo is more different. I kind of miss the old one. Here is a gray version. A blue version, the green version, a yellow slash gold version, a 3D version, a purple version just like the Yahoo logo, the white version, an icon and a GIF.
2015 to the present, the font has changed. Here is the gray version, the light gray version, the blue version, the green version, the yellow version, the purple version, the 3D version, the white version, the symbol and a GIF. Okay, so 2015 to present. We I put a um I put a sketch in all of the letters. This will look a bit detailed. to the present. The font of the text has changed the font we all know and love today. And I gotta say, it looks pretty cool. Yeah. 2015 to the present, the font changed. Previous, current. Previous, current. That's all for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Logo History, and I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new episode. Stay tuned for episode 206. Yahoo! and Internet Explorer. Bye bye Stay tuned for episode 19. Capcom Summit Entertainment at CCG88. By the way, I'm not going to talk about CCG88 because I couldn't find it in Logopedia. So bye, viewers. And why? Freaky watch of Walker History. Stay tuned for next one. I don't know. Bye for now. That's the end of the episode. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. Come and like, subscribe, and see you guys later. Also, if I don't get any questions for the next three months that are tenable, the community will be cancelled forever. Also, thank you for episode 10 of the History 10. Nintendo! You know, the company that's famous for the Mario and Zelda games. Bye. Alright, that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching episode 21 of Logo History. And I'll see you in a few minutes for a brand new episode. Oh, I'm sorry. The next episode is NBC. Bye. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Logo Street. I'll see you tomorrow for another new episode. Stay tuned for episode 6. T H Q and P Pi. Bye for now. Alright, this is it for today, guys. Next episode, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Request me a logo for it. Requested Sunday logos. Bye. And request me a logo for me to do an episode free. Bye! Thank you for watching this episode. See you next month for another episode. Stay tuned for episode number two. Google Play. Boy. Alright guys, that is it for today. I hope you enjoy this episode. Stay tuned for episode 36, which is going to be all about Dairy Queen. Bye for now. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Logo History, and I'll see you guys for a brand new episode. Stay tuned for episode 4, Nicktoons. Bye 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 bye. Okay guys, this is it for today. I really hope you liked it. Stay tuned for episode 89, that is going to be about Telltale Productions, Uber, Sesame Street and Patel Company Credit Union. And also don't forget to join my Discord server, and to subscribe to my channel, so you can watch my daily videos. I am Peter John, this is Logo History and until tomorrow, bye. So that's gonna wrap it up for episode 2, so I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you next time for the next one. Alright, that's it for now guys, thank you so much.
much for watching this episode of Logo History, especially Robert. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. I don't know what the next episode of Logo History collab is. I don't know what episode 7 is. But stay tuned for episode 7 anyways. Bye-bye! Alright, that's it for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next episode. Bye for now! Hey there, guys. Robert here. Thank you so much for watching this episode of the Logo History Collab. Please be sure to be on a lookout for the next episode on McDonald's. Please note that if you are a YouTuber that mainly does Logo History videos and you already did a Logo History video on McDonald's, please let me know in the comments so you could potentially be a part of the next video. Also, I'm only accepting 15 users for the collab, so let me know in advance before your spot gets taken away. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel with notifications turned on so you don't miss a single video from me, as we're on the road to 4000 subs. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in the next video. Peace out everybody.